it's Nancy today. Well, I'm in this room where I'm going to have the my the Persantine MyoView stress test. So I'm now. I hope I'm all covered up decently. Yes, good. Oh shoot. Um, I'm all hooked up to many um, electrodes, which shows it's an an active ECG. So they're being able to watch my heart. And I have this in my arm. She's now putting in the persantine. And it takes about five minutes to... Yes, yeah, so she, it'll take her about five minutes for that all to go into my body. And there may be some side effects. I may feel nauseous or dizzy or get a headache. Is that right? Okay. And this is going to... Uh, let's see. This will start making my heart go faster, right? It's a basal dilator. It's just simulating exercise. So it's a vasodilator. dilator. It is simulating exercise. So after this, um, so you only inject it once, right? Three or, times. Oh, you inject it three times. No, this one's once. That's right. So, so this gets injected once, and then this is what's going to make my heart go faster and faster and faster. That doesn't actually, but it opens the blood vessels. Oh, it opens the blood vessels. So that's what happens when you're getting exercise, eh? Your blood vessels are opening. So that's how they are simulating me getting exercise, is they're just opening my blood vessels. That's quite interesting. That's what nitroglycerin does too, doesn't it? Hmm, interesting. I could see why I'd get a headache then. Yeah, because nitro will give you a headache. You've had that happen, haven't you? I knew you did. Okay, um, I feel the same. A little cold somewhere, maybe. I suppose that's from this, the wires that are on me. Okay, then after this persantine is in, then they'll inject some more radioactive dye, which I guess will go into my heart muscle, and so they'll be able to see it with the gamma camera again later. And also, after all that, to counteract the persantine, is that what it's called? Persantine? Persantine, yeah. After they have finished giving me all these things, there's an antidote for the persantine which I guess will then shrink the blood vessels. You know that's interesting because when you get a migraine, you get a migraine because your blood vessels are all dilated in your brain, in your head. I wonder if the antidote for this would also be good for getting rid of migraines. Has there been research done on that? Um, they're using some beta blockers now. The, uh, now the thing that, um, the antidote, what is the antidote? I mean often. Aminophilin? Aminophilin. Aminophilin, that's the antidote. Is it a beta blocker? No, not. It's, it's a caffeine based. It's a caffeine based. Hmm. Interesting. And that, that constricts your blood vessels. Caffeine does. Well, it's going to stop the first one from working. Right. So, so it'll stop the persentine from working. Interesting. Well, I wonder if caffeine then will help with a migraine. Oh, it's supposed to. If I had known that when I had all those migraines, well, my son gets migraines, so now that I know that, I'll feed him Coke when he gets a migraine. Okay, I'm getting a little tired, so I'm going to stop moving this now. Goodbye. You can do this, too.